Phil Spencer says Xbox could be shut down if Game Pass doesn't grow anymore. <laughs> Or at least till 2027. Let's get into it. What is up, guys? It's your boy Hercules, and we are back at it again. Yes, you heard that right. Phil Spencer says Xbox could be shut down by Microsoft if Game Pass does not grow faster. And well, sorry to admit, but I do believe this is true. And the reason why I do believe this is true, because look at the numbers of how much money they're spending for this Game Pass. You would believe Game Pass would be at about 120 million subscribers, but they're still sitting. Some are reporting at 30 million, but the last time I saw was like they're sitting around 27 million subscribers, and that's not a good number especially with the amount of money that you're spending for these IPs out there, you would think you would have a bigger subscription. Sony has a bigger subscription, but the problem is they don't go out and buy these big studios, these big IPs just to throw it in there. They're gonna develop these games People are just signing up to get these free games whenever the subscription gives it to you every month. When it comes to Xbox, they are out there. They try doing the indie stuff. They thought going the indie route was gonna help and it didn't, it failed. Now they're going with the big studio purchases when they should have, what, what, what should they have done? They should have started buying smaller studios they should have bought smaller studios and start developing games. Now, if these games would have come out and they would have been trash, then go ahead, buy Call of Duty, buy Capcom, buy Sega, buy all these brands that you could because that's your last result. But it looks like Xbox was like, you know what? We can't. We had a couple failed games from Xbox Studios we have to just jump in and buy everything. And they're trying to buy everything. Even Phil having these daydreaming thoughts of buying Nintendo, which is just hilarious and pathetic. But this is how desperate Xbox is for Game Pass to grow. At the end of the day, I've been saying Xbox doesn't care about exclusive games. They don't. Now, will they make some games exclusive? Yes, because they would think that's gonna drive in more people to subscribe to their service. But I wanna see those numbers. I wanna see if Starfield was able to draw in more subscriptions. I wanna see if Redfall, I wanna see if Hi-Fi Rush, because at the end of the day, Hi-Fi Rush may be a critically claimed game but at the end of the day, 25 million subscribers, only 2 million subscribers played it. That's not a good look. I'm sorry, but that's not a good look. Let me know what you guys think down below. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time. I've ridiculed everyone on the roster. I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. <laughs>